Hey everybody, Scott Sprinter here, DocSports.com, and welcome to the update for Friday. Uh, we've got a free pick coming up in Friday morning, Korean baseball in just a moment. We'll get to that. Been an outstanding run in soccer. It continues. We cashed again on Thursday. Appreciate those of you who jumped on board a seven-star play on Thursday. And uh, we've got a five-star play going on Friday. Going to tell you about what's going on with our soccer if you're new to these videos. Uh, but going all the way back to April 18th, we've been on a heck of a run in soccer. And in fact, our current run has us up nearly four $4,500 for $100 per unit betters. That's with all soccer plays, no matter the rating, no matter the league. It's been going well. And uh, we're 63% since June 23rd. That's 24 plays since June 23rd. We've hit 63% of our soccer plays. And the seven star and six star plays, the elite level plays, they are now up over $6,600 for $100 per unit betters on this current run. So it's been outstanding. Got a five star going on Friday. Uh, you can go grab it anytime. The play will be posted at 11.30 a.m. Eastern, 8.30 a.m. Pacific. Just one soccer play on Friday. It's a side. Uh, it goes at 3 p.m. Eastern on Friday afternoon. And again, it is rated five stars. So be sure to grab that if you want to jump on board uh, on the pitch. As far as everything else, uh, we wanted to recap what happened last night. We were talking about NASCAR real quickly uh, yesterday. And we did cash our premium pick with Chase Elliott. He ended up winning the race. We had a five star on Chase Elliott. <clears throat> Excuse me. And that'll take us into the weekend uh, on a 35 and 16 NASCAR Cup Series run. We'll be back with NASCAR on Sunday morning. We'll talk a little bit more about that as we get closer to uh, Sunday. So anyway, nice run. 80% is our current short-term run of NASCAR 35 and 16, almost 70% with our last 51. As far as everything else, I've told you soccer is going to be available on Friday. We did pass premium action in Korean baseball for Friday morning. I do expect uh, to be back in action for Saturday's card in KBO uh, after looking at probable pitching matchups. Uh, those plays or that play will be available Friday afternoon at 3.30 p.m. Eastern, 12.30 p.m. Pacific. Got to get back on track in the KBO. I uh, had a play on Thursday morning and we had a 10 to 4 lead. We lost 15 to 10. Been a lot of wacky stuff going on in late innings in KBO of late. But uh, passed on Friday morning's card back on Friday afternoon with the play for Saturday. All right, uh, the golf play, uh, he's hanging around talking about Abraham Answer. We told uh, told you that we liked him uh, plus around 200 to finish in the top 20 for the entire tournament. And he's sitting around oh, 25th, top 25 right now. So that's what we want. We want him to get to uh, the weekend, make the cut, get to the weekend with a decent shot at that top 20 finish. Nice ticket at plus 200. All right, let's get to the free KBO play for Friday morning. It goes at 5.30 a.m. Eastern, 2.30 a.m. Pacific time. It's the class between Dusan and Kia and uh, Kia right now laying about a buck 35 to a buck 45 so shop around in fact I saw as low as a dollar 33 right before cutting this video but those are few and far between likely be able to find a buck 35 dollar 40 at the most when you look at Dusan the pitcher that they're going to send to the mound in this particular game his last four starts have not gone well I mean he's been absolutely crushed and tagged 793 ERA a whip of almost a buck 90 and one of the problems is it's not a high strikeout league but he's really really down when it comes to strikeouts so of late 4.7 strikeouts per nine innings pitched during this little slide for him and we know about the Bears they already allow the second most runs per game in the entire KBO so uh, we do expect Kia to get to this pitcher his name is you and um, and we think that they'll get to him enough to get this win they're five and two on the last seven playing well and Kia which hasn't always been great earlier this summer as far as what they've done at the plate while well, they're averaging over seven runs per per game in the last seven games. Best defense in the league already all season long as far as runs per game allowed and opponents OBP. Uh, and then I like the starting pitcher tonight. You got Aaron Brooks. He's had a tremendous season. And his last eight games especially, how about a 2.15 ARA and a 103 whip? Uh, so I like him here. He did punch out seven Doosan batters and five and a third when he faced them way back on May 17th. Kia did not get the victory in that one, uh, but we expect him to get the win here. So we'll back Kia, again, laying about a buck 35 buck 40 over Dusan on Friday morning in the KBO. And that's going to do it for me for Friday morning. Uh, we do expect to be back on Friday between 8 p.m. and 10 p.m. Eastern time. We'll have a play from either Saturday's KBO or soccer. Uh, best of luck on Friday. Let's put them in the win column. I'm Scott Sprites of DocSports.com. If you like the videos, click on that thumbs up or be sure to subscribe to appreciate those who have done so thus far. Let's have a great Friday.